Hi friends, in this video, I am joining with a notification from BHL, Bharat Heavy Electrical Limited, Tirchrapoli. So, this is regarding apprenticeship recruitment. So, first, we will have a discussion regarding technician apprentice. So, first, I am opening this technician apprentice notification. So, this is a notification released by Bharat Heavy Electrical Limited. So, first, we will have a discussion regarding this vacancy and educational qualification, eligibility and selection methodology. Then, we will have a detailed review regarding how to apply. So most of the students are asking how to apply for this post. So this is a bit different from other procedure. So we will have a detailed review regarding this registration part. So first I am starting with the uh, number of posts, eligibility and method of selection. So these are all the discipline, mechanical discipline, uh, computer science engineering, IT, civil, triple E, ECE, and instrumentation and control this means ICE so these are all the discipline total 90 vacancies are there okay so age limit is minimum 18 years maximum 27 years and relaxation will be followed as per government of the norms and minimum educational qualification high school pass and diploma pass uh, 70 percentage marks for unreserved and OBC and EWS economically weaker section candidate 60 percentage marks for SCST candidate so this is regarding minimum education qualification and reservation will be followed as per government of India norms and reservation for dependents of regular employees serving and retired deceased is to be followed. This is the extra reservation. So next is a very important part, selection methodology. Selection methodology is same as engineering apprentice recruitment. So first merit list will be prepared based upon your test, your uh, diploma mark. Afterwards, you will be called for the assessment test. So based on this result in this assessment test, the final result will be declared. So first step is merit list based on your marks uh, in the diploma, afterwards assessment test. So assessment test will give the final selection. So minimum physical standards also follow. Uh, this was very important because this training will be given by under apprenticeship act, government of India apprenticeship act 1973. So this already completed candidates training completed candidates and whoever is undergoing those candidates are not eligible to apply so duration of training is one year stipend is 8000 per month so next if we are moving on registration part so registration part we have to see very carefully because this was bit different from other registration that's why i am saying we will have a detailed review regarding registration also so this is very important so the registration will start with first mhrd nats portal so what I am saying, if you are a diploma candidate, irrespective of company who uh, is uh, released the notification, uh, either BHCL or even CPCL or even uh, uh, lot of PSUs, even BPCL also released uh, this apprenticeship recruitment. So irrespective of company recruitment, first you register yourself with this MHRD website. So through this registration, you will get this enrollment number. So this 16 digit enrollment number, this is very, very, very important. So this is a common number uh, with this only you can proceed for any company. So with this number, you can proceed for any apprenticeship uh, recruitment for any company. Now you have registered with this MHRD website. If you are getting this 16 en uh, digit enrollment number, then you can eligible to apply for this uh, apprenticeship recruitment BHL portal. So once your registration is completed with this MSRD website, then move on to BHL portal. Okay, that explanation is mentioned very clearly here. So, first step is MSRD registration. Through that, what you will get? 16 digit enrollment ID. So, with that ID, go here, click this website https3c.bhl.com portal, click apprenticeship application portal. So, click the link register from the menu. Then, uh, I agree after reading all the instruction then fill your registration form and submit by register okay then what you will get otp so otp will be coming to your mobile mail id registered mail id mobile number through this you will create password also so your registration in bhl website is completed afterwards log into the portal the same portal uh, using your new password and this id okay afterwards fill your application form and submit these documents so these are all the do these documents you want to upload in this portal uh, in your application portal what are the documents passport size photograph signature 10th mark sheet consolidated mark sheet 
community certificate, Aadhaar card, candidate profile home page screenshot and bank passbook front page as uploaded in the government portal. See here, it is very clearly mentioned whatever application uh, you have, whatever registration you have done in this MISRD website, that time whatever the bank passbook front page used, same copy to be used for your BSC registration also. So this is regarding registration part. So I, I think I have cleared this registration part. Next I am moving to this, this part. This part is same as uh, registration part because these are all the document requirement. So this I already explained. And next these are all general conditions only. Okay. This, no TA, DA shall be paid to the candidate for appearing in this assessment test. It is very clearly mentioned. Next is upon completion of apprenticeship period at BHL 3 g the government of India concern. BHL shall have no obligation to offer employment. It is very clearly mentioned. Okay. So next the dates part. So opening date is 24th August. Closing date is 7th September. I think today is 6. So we have only one day cut off. So whoever is not applied, please hurry up your registration. So 7th September 11.45. So last date and time for this registration. So this is for engagement of technician apprenticeship for the year 2020-2022-23. Okay. So under the Apprenticeship Act 1973. This, this is for Diploma uh, candidates. So this is the Diploma holders in engineering for one year. Okay. So that's all friends. This is regarding uh, Diploma Apprenticeship for this BSCL. So we will have a separate video for IT Apprenticeship. Okay friends. Thank you.